फ्रेंड्स माय सेल्फ डॉक्टर के डब्ल्यू पवार फ्रॉम डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ बॉटनी रेत शिक्षण संस्था राव बहादुर नारायण राव बोरावकी कॉलेज श्रीरामपुर डिस्ट्रिक्ट अहमदनगर टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डील ऑन द लैंडस्केप गार्डनिंग द टॉपिक इज फ्रॉम क्लास थर्ड इयर बी एस सी देर इज द पेपर दैट इज हॉर्टिकल्चर एंड फ्लोरिकल्चर हॉर्टिकल्चर एंड फ्लोरिकल्चर एंड इन दैट देर इज द चैप्टर दैट इज द ऑर्नामेंटल गार्डनिंग फ्रॉम दिस देर इज द लैंडस्केप गार्डनिंग लास्ट वीडियो वी हैड सीन द ओरिजिन एंड हिस्ट्री ऑफ गार्डन्स देन देर इज द फेमस गार्डन्स ऑफ इंडिया एंड गार्डनिंग स्टाइल्स ओके नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू सी द लैंडस्केप गार्डनिंग लैंडस्केप गार्डनिंग इज अ वेरी फैसिनेटिंग एंड इंटरेस्टिंग सब्जेक्ट इट इज अ मनी स्पिनर बिजनेस एंड पीपल दोज हु हैव इन्वॉल्व इन द पर्टिकुलर लैंडस्केप गार्डनिंग दे अर्न द हैंडसम अमाउंट ऑफ द मनी दोज पीपल हु आर इन्वॉल्व इन द पर्टिकुलर लैंडस्केप गार्डनिंग दे अर्न द पर्टिकुलर हैंडसम मनी और मोर अमाउंट ऑफ द मनी सो वॉट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ द लैंडस्केप गार्डनिंग वॉट डज इट मीन्स इट मीन्स दैट देर इज द इट इज एन अस्थेटिक ब्रांच ऑफ द हॉर्टिकल्चर विच डील्स विद द अप्लीकेशन ऑफ गार्डन फॉर्म्स different styles methods and material view to improve the landscape okay so very simple one one can understand the landscape gardening there is the it is an aesthetic branch of horticulture which deals with the here there is the application of forms different styles methods and materials applications of diff, uh, garden forms different styles is there then methods is there and material is there with view to improve the particular landscape okay then <coughs> a beautiful landscape is a vital part of our home or what we called the community it is important part of our home or what we called it as our community landscape designing work <coughs> on the canvas that is the distinctly different from other forms okay then the landscape designer use the landscape designer use the design process landscape designer use the design process that systematically considered all the aspect of the land where there is the they consider the all aspects of the particular land envir land also the environment then there is the growing plants need of used to ensure a uh, <coughs> visually pleasing it is most important that there is the visually pleasing then functional and ecological healthy design okay so the fundamental concept of the landscape design what is the fundamental concept behind the particular landscape design is to problem solving fundamental concept is that is to problem solving the use of horticultural science then artful composition first thing is that it is the problem solving <coughs> concept of landscape designing is the problem solving concept 
थ्रू दी यूज ऑफ दी पर्टिकुलर हॉर्टिकल्चरल साइंस देन द आर्टफुल कंपोजिशन एंड स्पेशल ऑर्गेनाइजेशन टू क्रिएट अट्रैक्टिव एंड फंक्शनल आउटडोर रूम्स फॉर दी पर्टिकुलर डिफरेंट यूजेस ओके सो देर आर दी टू थिंग्स इज देयर फर्स्ट थिंग इज दैट देर इज दी पर्टिकुलर एलिमेंट्स एलिमेंट्स ऑफ दी लैंडस्केप डिजाइन एंड एलिमेंट्स मीन्स वॉट देर इज दी विजुअल क्वालिटी एलिमेंट्स मीन्स वॉट देर इज दी विजुअल क्वालिटी मीन्स वॉट विजुअल क्वालिटी मीन्स वॉट देर इज दी पर्टिकुलर लाइन फॉर्म्स टेक्स्चर्स देन देर इज दी कलर इन केस ऑफ दी विजुअल क्वालिटी देर इज दी लाइन फॉर्म्स टेक्स्चर एंड कलर that is what the particular elements that is the visual qualities and another one is that there is the principles principles of designs of the particular landscape okay so here first thing is that there is the elements of the particular design of the landscape and another thing is that there is the what sort of the principles that are based on the particular landscape designing there is the rhythm then balance then there is the proportion of scale then there is the unity then there is the particular focal point then there is the mass effect and uh, again again that is the levels okay so these are the these are the principles these are the principles that is uh, that is the landscape designing based on that particular principle friends uh, we uh, move towards the first of all towards the particular elements what are the elements of the landscape design the first thing is that there is the line okay line the particular line forms texture and color from this line line creates all forms and patterns what is that line create the all forms and patterns can be used in a variety of ways the pattern the pattern that used in the variety of ways and this pattern is created by the particular line okay this pattern is created by the particular line so line creates all forms and patterns can be used in variety of ways then landscape designers use line to cre create what is the use of line to create the pattern to develop the space and uh, create the forms okay then the control moments and establish the dominance and create the cohesive themes create the cohesive themes okay what what is the use of the particular lines what is the use of the lines so landscape designers or horticulturists are specifically what we call landscape designers uh, use the line to create the pattern develop space create forms control movements establish the dominance and and there is the create the cohesive theme in the particular landscape okay so this this these all things that is in the particular landscape then the properties of lines what is the properties of line in that particular landscape the properties of lines determine how people respond to landscape what is the property of line the property of lines determine how people respond to landscape both emotionally and another one is the physically that is what that is what the how how people they are respond to the particular landscape or design of the uh, one of the landscape uh, both the emotionally as well as the physically then second thing is that there is the particular forms second thing in case of the elements or what we call there is the visual qualities there is the forms these are the visual qualities uh, shape is created by outline 
that encloses a space while form is the three dimensional mass of shape okay what is form the form is the form is the three dimensional mass of that particular shape okay the form of structure form of structure plant beds and garden ornaments <coughs> also determine the overall form theme of the garden so here what is that the form of structure the form of structure plant beds garden and ornaments also determine the overall forms or theme of the particular garden okay so this is the about the line and forms then <coughs> then there is the uh, there is about the particular texture third thing is that there is the texture okay texture <coughs> texture what is texture texture is defined as the relationship among the what is this it is defined as relationship among the among the foliage twig size twig size and mass of the plant and mass of the particular plant okay what is structure structure is defined as or one can define the structure that is the relationship among the foliage twig or what we call twig size foliage twig size and uh, mass of the particular plant close up close up uh, structure comes from the there is the close up texture that comes from the size and shape of the leaves shape of the leaves okay <clears throat> the size of twig the close up structure comes from the size and shape of leaves then there is the size of twig the second thing is that size of twig size of <coughs> twig then there is the spacing of leaves leaves and twig color and there is the particular what is that twig color okay these things are important what is that close up structure <coughs> comes from the size and shape of the leaves size and shape of the leaves then the size of the twig then spacing of leaves then twig color and another one thing is that there is the shading there is the shading another one thing is that there is the sh shading so what is the texture there is the relationship among the particular foliage twig size and the mass of the particular plant then next one in case of element or what we called visual effect there is the particular color okay color <coughs> fourth thing is that there is the color the color in plant material and a hardscape the color in plant material and hardscape add interest and variety add interest 
इंटरेस्ट एंड वराइटी टू द लैंडस्केप लैंडस्केप ओके सो कलर ऑफ द प्लांट मटेरियल कलर ऑफ द प्लांट मटेरियल एंड हार्डस्केप एंड इंटरेस्ट एंड वराइटी टू दी पर्टिकुलर लैंडस्केप इट इज द मोस्ट कॉन्सिपियस इट इज द मोस्ट कॉन्सिपियस इन केस ऑफ कलर द टेम्प्ररी एलिमेंट इन द लैंडस्केप वॉट इज दैट द टेम्प्ररी एलिमेंट इन द लैंडस्केप लास्टिंग फॉर द लास्टिंग कलर लास्टिंग फॉर द फ्यू वीक्स कलर लास्टिंग फॉर द फ्यू वीक्स और फ्यू ईयर्स टू दी पर्टिकुलर योरी प्लांट ओके देन नेक्स्ट इज दैट प्रिंसिपल ऑफ डिजाइन प्रिंसिपल ऑफ डिजाइन वेन देर इज द पर्टिकुलर लैंडस्केप इज देयर वॉट इज दैट प्रिंसिपल ऑफ डिजाइनिंग डिजाइन और डिजाइनिंग मीन्स वॉट देर इज द गाइडलाइन वेन टू क्रिएट द सम लैंडस्केप और टू क्रिएट अ लैंडस्केप वन शुड नो दी वॉट इज द प्रिंसिपल्स ऑफ द डिजाइन और वॉट इज द गाइडलाइन ऑफ द डिजाइन मीन्स वॉट आई विल tell you in, in brief that is the first of all there is the rhythm 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 okay in case of the particular rhythm what is the rhythm rhythm is the relation of some object at a equidistant what is this relation relation of object relation of some object at equidistance is called rhythm at equidistance is called rhythm okay so relation of the particular sum object at equidistance is called the particular rhythm so the when there is the designing of the landscape the first and foremost principle or guideline that is the rhythm and what is that the relation of object to the particular equidistance that is the uh, what we called the <clears throat> rhythm repeating line repeating line forms colors in case of rhythm and texture create the rhythm in the landscape Re repeating line forms then colors then texture that creates the rhythm in the particular landscape then next that is the balance it is again to maintain the balance is necessary balance is the concept of it is the concept of equal visual equal visual attraction equal visual it equal visual attraction and weight weight we know that usually around usually usually <coughs> usually around a real real or imaginary central axis real or or imaginary 
इमेजिनरी सेंट्रल एक्सिस ओके सो दिस इज दैलेंस इट इज अगेन इंपॉर्टेंट इट इज द कंसेप्ट वॉट इज बैलेंस इट इज द कंसेप्ट ऑफ इक्वल विजुअल अट्रैक्शन दिस इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ऑफ इक्वल विजुअल अट्रैक्शन एंड वेट यूजली अराउंड द रियल एंड इमेजिनरी सेंट्रल एक्सिस ओके सो दिस इज बैलेंस देन नेक्स्ट थिंग इज दैट प्रोपोर्शन और स्केल अनादर थिंग इज दैट proportion or what we call it as the scale okay someone called it as the proportion someone called it as the scale relative proportion is the size of an object relative proportion is the size of an object in relation to size of and of an object in relation relation to to other object okay so this is again the proportion or the scale relative proportion what is relative proportion what is the proportion or what we call it as the scale the it is what the relative proportion is the size of an object in a relation to the other object in relation to the particular in relation to the particular other object okay absolute proportion absolute proportion is the scale or size of an object absolute proportion is a scale or size an object and this is calculated on the human image or human size okay then there is the unity next one unity okay this one is the proportion of scale then there is the unity unity is achieved this particular unity is achieved by linking element and features it is achieved by linking element and feature to create a constant character in the constant character in the composition okay so unity is achieved by linking element or the features to create a constant character in the in the particular composition then <coughs> there are the again uh, some uh, some principles that are involved in the particular uh, designing that is the particular focal point then there is the particular mass effect mass effect of the uh, particular plants then there is the water bodies <coughs> and uh, particular whatever the material then there is the uh, uh, particular uh, what we call the Uh, mass effect and uh, another one principle what is that there is the levels when there is the designing of some landscape it uh, it is a uh, most important that levels is important because it is uh, it is very easy to develop the landscape at the flat level but when there is the uh, different sort of level that time uh, that particular levels can be again very important okay so these are the about uh, the elements and the principles about the particular landscape designing okay so one can design the landscape on the particular things okay <coughs> thank you